Hello, Brandon. This is Smirdly. I'm a fan of the Hot Banana Stud Show. Uh, and you didn't mention me in your shout-out. Uh, let me have a few comments I could make on, on your latest video. Um, to which this is a video response. Let's see, in terms of the claim that someone said you were ugly, no, you're not ugly. Not at all. Uh, I'm ugly. I'm massively ugly. At least I get told that constantly and continually on YouTube. Uh, by people who tell me I'm old and that I should go die. Well, let me tell you something. I applied for the um, partnership program twice and I was turned down twice, all right? And um, I'm never going to apply again. And insofar as um, you being a celebrity, or being famous. To quote one of my favorite movies, Whatever Happened to Baby Jane, this is my message to you, Brandon. Oh, but you are famous, Brandon. You are. <laughs> that was Betty Davis um, telling Joan Crawford, but you are in a wheelchair. Oh, well. Um, Being well groomed. I'm not well groomed. Look at me. I'm unshaven. Oh, look at that little little hair up here. What is the Smirdly Show? The Smirdly Show is character acting, and um, um, I can do anything I want to. Basically, what I'm good at is um, I don't know. When I was a little kid, I always idolized Tom. Um, Actors like Boris Karloff and Bela Lugosi in those old movies because they were creepy looking and Peter Lorre, okay? And uh, my favorite of the Three Stooges, <laughs> in case you were wondering, well, everybody's favorite was Curly, but I also liked Shemp, and I always hoped I would grow up to look like Shemp and have big bags under my eyes because I thought that was cool looking, and I have little bags under my eyes, but um, part of the reason why I'm so ugly is because I'm 57 years old, and because in December of 2005, I got tired of being sick all the time, and um, I was sick all the time, and sweating profusely, and my head constantly hurt back here, behind my sinus, and my eyeball hurt, and I thought I had a brain tumor, or else I thought I had Parkinson's, because I was having trouble walking, and I was shuffling, and falling to one side, and leaning to my left constantly, and um, slobbering all over myself, I still slobber, and I was diagnosed in the hospital with Polycythemia vera, and um, um, they saved my life. Actually, um, they put—it's a terminal illness, and it's um, incurable. And they don't know what the cause of it is. And what it does is it makes my um, blood cells replicate like crazy. Okay, and um, I got so thick they couldn't even pull the blood out of me. Okay, the blood got so thick and sluggish, and I probably should have died, but. What they did finally, I had to teach them how to phlebotomize me, you know, because um, they didn't even know how to phlebotomize. I mean, they were doing it all wrong. And um, essentially, they put me on chemotherapy, which is um, in capsule form, hydroxyurea, and it doesn't make my hair fall out. And um, it may be a little nauseous at first, but it retards and slows the growth of the development of this thing into leukemia. Okay, it's a pre leukemia condition and um, anyways I'm ugly and um, those of you who send me messages all the time and tell me to hurry up and die be patient be patient I will die eventually if not from um, the polycythemia vera <coughs> but from side effects from the medication or I might get killed by a car or I might just go to a YouTube convention sometime if they have one near here and people will jump on me and beat me to death and kill me and get rid of me. Um, 
but I keep making I keep making YouTube videos and regardless of what people say oh yeah and Fred Phelps about 10 years ago I ran across Fred Phelps on, on, on the internet and I thought it was funny you know I thought it was a joke you know um, but as time went by I realized that um, Fred Phelps is not a joke and his little inbred family um, it, all right, imagine if Fred Phelps was right and God did hate fags and did, God did hate America. Why take it out on the families of people who die of AIDS or, or war veterans? Why ruin their funerals, all right? And um, as for your video about having a big sex orgy um, when Fred Phelps dies, why stoop to their level, you know? Um, it's kind of like um, Saddam Hussein. He was turned over to a lynching mob and they wouldn't even let him finish his prayers, you know. I saw the um, cell phone video of his hanging, and he's trying to do this, la 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 stuff he was doing. And they were yelling, go to hell, in their language, and distracting him from his prayers. And then they dropped the um, trap door on him and hung him. They didn't give him enough time to finish his prayers. To Allah, all right, that's disrespectful. You know, no matter what kind of person he was, they should have let him finish his prayers. Um, but they didn't. Okay, why Why um, have a big sex orgy at Fred Phelps' funeral? Um, but anyways, I like the Hot Banana Stud show. And um, I subscribe to you even though you're famous and you're so much greater than I am. And you're a millionaire. You have, you have someone else to hold the camera for you. And, and you have a better camera. And, and you're infinitely wealthy. You have credit cards. I've never had a credit card in my life. Hot Banana Stud, Brandon. Um, but, um, my God, I'm senile. <laughs> I like your show, and this is, um, this is my way of, well, just riding on your coattails to fame to get more exposure. And of course, everybody's going to, you know, Criticize me until I'm old and I look like a murderer. <laughs> and um, call me a pedophile. That's a real common one. They like calling me a pedophile because everybody thinks that anyone over the age of 30 who is on the internet is obviously there to lure children in. Now let me ask you, what kind of child would be attracted to me in the first place, okay? Even if I was a pedophile, I scare kids. <laughs> Mm. Anyways, um, congratulations on your show and congratulations on your fame and um, um, your, your, your partnership status. And even though you're infinitely better than I am, Allah, Allah, la, 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 la. I'm still a supporter of the Hot Banana Stud show. And I love your videos and I think they're funny. And um, I wouldn't even care if you were heterosexual. I'd still like you. Okay? The end.